I go to 7-Eleven, I buy some stuff. 11-11. Lucky 11s. I look at the date, it's 11-11. I look at the time, it's 11-11. I start to see these 11s everywhere. When I followed them, I found these eyes. I'd like to tell you the story of the eyes that changed this world. When I saw you, I had the feeling that I had known you. Like we are connected from past lives. I don't believe in that. What do you believe in? I'm a scientist. I believe in proof. Burning. Every person on this planet has their own unique pair of eyes. You ever feel like when you met someone, they fill this hole inside of you? Are you okay, man? <laughs> yeah, okay. The way you talked was, like, poetic. <laughs> to me, the best thing about living like a lab rat is that sometimes you actually discover something. You know, the white peacock symbolizes souls being dispersed throughout the world. Keep dreaming. We'd like to get married. <laughs> There is no proof that there is some magical spirit living above us. Why are you working so hard to disprove God? Sophie? Sophie? Sophie! Ah! I never got to say goodbye. What if I bring you something that'll take your breath away? Check this out. There's a girl born in India with Sophie's exact iris pattern. Impossible. Maybe the eye really is some kind of window to the soul. You should go to India. I'm looking for someone. All I have is a picture of their eyes. Could you help me find her? What would you do if something spiritual disproved your scientific beliefs? Most people's doors are completely closed. What's behind the door? Love and anger and fear and joy and sadness. All at once.